guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and it's Pelotonia weekend. I'm putting my shoe on, I had a rock in it. So I wanna start the weekend off. I'm wearing my shirt that I made. It says Pelotonia 2021. And here's all the names of the people that donated to my ride. So I am actually headed out got my wristband on so today is Friday just got off work and we have opening ceremonies downtown so we'll drive down we will park we will go into lower.com stadium and yes we will have all the fun times so I want to bring you along but I thought I would start it off by letting you know what's going on so tonight is opening ceremonies we'll go down and I don't know what it's gonna look like due to COVID and then tomorrow is the ride. So let's get going. We're excited. Questionable. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> Look at my crazy hair. It's Pelotonia day. I've got my jersey on. I don't love this part, but this is what it looks like. Go Pelotonia. I've got my shorts on. I'm brewing some coffee. I've got my two water bottles. And I went to, or my cousin went for me, a bakery where she lives. It's called the Keto Cafe and got me a bagel and then some treats for when I come home. Um, typically I wouldn't eat even a keto bagel. It's just a lot of unnecessary, you know, carbohydrates really. They're hard to make too low, but it's fine for today because I need some carbs. I need to fuel my body. I'll show you what it looks like. Putting cream cheese on it. I'll show you the baked goods. Actually, I just showed you the bagel. This is just the bottom half. It was very large, so I'm only doing half the bagel with cream cheese. I'm going to cut it. Um, I just fed the boys their breakfast. Putting my cream cheese away. Um, when I had my 50th birthday party, my cousin Debbie got me these treats. I don't know if you can see them, but these are, that's a blueberry bar and these are Buckeye brownies. So they're chocolate brownies with peanut butter frosting and like probably Lily's chocolate chips on top. So this is my treat for when I come home. Because I have to have a treat, right? I mean, I think I do. Last night was so much fun. I didn't get much footage. It was more just walking around and um, absorbing the energy of the day. You know, everybody wanting to, I just turn the light off, everybody getting excited for the ride. Um, the foundation was kind of, they brought people out to speak. There was a triathlete there that had just won a silver medal at the Olympics. Um, we were at the Columbus Crew Soccer Stadium that they just built this year. This is the opening year. So we were there and one of the, um, I'm gonna make coffee while we talk. One of the old soccer players, he doesn't, I don't know if he plays anymore, but he has ridden in Pelotonia for nine years. And that's what's really cool too about Pelotonia. There's a lot of athletes in the Columbus area, like the Columbus Blue Jackets, which is our hockey team. Um, Ohio State, obviously, but we also have the crew. And then we have a baseball, uh, double A or something. Not, not like, uh, like a theater team, the Clippers. But a lot of the athletes that are here in town participate. In Pelotonia. I know there was a bunch of hockey players that rode two years ago. So I'm putting my coffee in styrofoam so I can take it with me and then just throw it away and not have to worry about that. I'm a little nervous. There's a lot of miles ahead of me today, but I feel like I can get it done. Ugh. All right. 
right, I'll check in when we get downtown. Number one, cousin Debbie, friend Wendy, let's go find Speedy. Here we get snacks. Say hi, Wendy. Hi, Debbie. We're getting ready to ride. Here's Speedy. There we go. Stop number two. Say hi, Wendy. Uh, show everybody your Oh, I ran into Wendy. Oops. Yeah. Sorry, Wendy. She got road rash and had to go to first aid. Say hi, Debbie. We're going to go get the world's best peanut butter sandwich. Ever. In the world. We're coming. Going to go over here. Show you our snacks. Bars. <gasps> here they are. Did you make the sandwiches? We sure did. did. Made with love. <laughs> Thank you. I feel the love. Good. Good, good. My peanut butter sandwich. Thank you. I love that. I don't know. 50 yards. Finish off that 50 miles. Welcome to the JP Morgan Fish. Okay. Pickerington rolling through. I'm coming. Awesome job, Team Huntington. Good morning, everybody. We are done with Pelotonia. It's Sunday. I kind of stopped recording halfway through the ride. I just started feeling really ill. And I, you know, I think it was my diabetes, but I'm not sure. So I had to stop at 44 miles, which makes me sad. But it is what it is. I still rode 44.3663 something miles. And I raised $1,810. So I'm proud of all those accomplishments. I just feel like I worked so hard to train and it just wasn't enough for whatever reason. Um, there were a lot of hills on that route and that really, it really um, did me in. So I'm done. I'm burnt. I'm drained today. Today will be a day spent editing videos I have to run a couple quick errands this morning just so I have food for the week and to go to the Dollar Tree so I can record a Dollar Tree video. I will be wearing the same outfit Monday and Tuesday because I'm just drained today. Like I don't have a lot of energy right now. I'm going to try to eat something, have some coffee and get some errands run. But I hope you enjoyed my look into Pelotonia. And again, thank you so very much for your support. I could not have done this without you. So thank you and have a great day, guys. I'll talk to you later.